I was born and raised in Lancaster, California. Um, I was born to an immigrant father from Mexico and to my mother who inspired me to become a nurse. As most young people, I grew up not knowing what I wanted to do with my life, but I knew I had a passion for helping people. And today, I can stand in front of you and say that I found a career that helps me find that passion. So with this scholarship, and my future goals are to graduate RN, um, move on to get my BSN, master's degree, and one day, it's far off, but one day mm -hmm. doctorate of nurse practitioner, and all the while serving my community and working as a nurse and doing what I love, which is helping people. I've never received a scholarship before ever, so when I received the email that I had gotten it, oh my gosh, I will tell you, I pro probably started crying. Uh -huh. <laughs> Called my husband first, and I'm like, oh my gosh, he's like, oh my gosh, and it was just, it was really, it's, I'm very fortunate, um, so thank you so much, and uh, with the scholarship, it gives me the opportunity to just really focus on what I need to do. I didn't think I could get into a master's program because my GPA wasn't great and I didn't think I was smart enough to do it. Um, but that, towards my last year at CSUN, um, I, had a, I had a boy, a baby boy, and he's going to be three now. Um, and that's what changed my perspective. I felt like I can't just stop at a bachelor's. I have to do more for him because I have to show him that there's, that we're, we're capable of doing and we're worthy of doing much more than just to settle. Mm -hmm. and, I'm going to be graduating with my Master's of Social Work in May, and I'm really excited. I'm going to be working for the county for the Department of Children and Family Services. I'm really excited. It's going to change my life. And my mom sat me down one night. She told me that if you cannot help yourself, you can't really help people in the future, like the doctors and the nurses who helped me getting through all this cancer. So yeah, she told me if you want to change, if you want to know the person who changed your life, take a look in the mirror, it's you. So I can't express how happy I was when I received a phone call from Stephanie on a Tuesday morning. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I just want to flip the table. I was like, oh my god, really? it was my, this, the scholarship is my first ever scholarship I have ever got in America. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you, everyone, for being here today. I started taking the classes for the nursing program. Um, I got accepted. I'm in my last semester. This semester I'll be graduating in May. Um, and so applying for this scholarship um, is very, receiving this scholarship is very important to me just because I never had a lot of support or people that believed in me. And so this um, just pushes me to to move forward, I'm going to buy the books that I need for my semester, my parking permit, my <laughs> ACLS class, it's like a couple hundred dollars that we need to do, um, and um, I, yeah, I have a lot of goals, I want to um, do the uh, family nurse practitioner program, and um, I my goals are to volunteer. Um, I want to travel internationally and volunteer at least, you know, every other year, every year, you know, when I get there. And um, I was hoping that, you know, if I can network throughout school and through these programs, um, and you do open up like a um, foundation for women that, you know, don't have anywhere to go and that need assistance. Um, and I just felt like I never really had that. And um, so a lot of my life experiences are why I am doing what I'm doing and I'm very passionate about it. And um, thank you for the scholarship.